guys and welcome back. So, got another review. Um, these two have finally come. We'll be doing a review of him as well. Um, yeah, Super Battle Droid has finally come and what a figure it is. It's really cool. Um, I wasn't expecting it to be great, but it is. Um, probably, you know, for, for a droid figure, obviously we've got the normal battle droids and it and it's pretty naff figure it doesn't really do much but this has got really good articulation for the figure um for what it is and um it just looks really cool as well so we're going over the articulation he doesn't come with anything uh, apart from the blaster effect here which just goes on to his um wrist there so that's what it looks like it's just a straight blaster effect so Looks wise, I mean, you can't really, there's nothing really you can go wrong with this. Looks wise, looks really good. Uh, size wise, um, he's taller than um, a lot of the normal figures. Um, but yeah, they've got the, the build really well, seeing as it's not a um, like a normal kind of Jedi or whatever figure human style figure like they did with the Droidica looks really good so um articulation his arms don't go up that far because they're hindered here with the um like shoulder bit so they, they kind of they tilt like a butterfly joint like that and then they go up mainly straight but you don't really see super battle droids doing that with their arm so it goes straight You've got the shoulder, um, the what's it, elbow rotation, and then you've also got the forearm rotation as well, and then the joint on the elbow goes right up, so you can kind of get it in that position when he's waiting to fire, and then his hand goes. Where is it? So you've got the articulation on the wrist, and then you've kind of got this. No, it's, it's not, but it's just a uh, articulation on hand, and then you've got this kind of bend here where it looks like it should uh, articulate, but it doesn't. It's just like solid, which is a bit weird. Like they could have they could have made that articulate a bit more, but it folds down like that, so you've got that kind of articulation there. So the crunch, he doesn't really have one. He goes back slightly that far, doesn't go forward at all. Rotates that far and rotates that far. Legs, uh, similar to the arms, they don't really go out too far, go out that far. Forward, they go all the way up. And then back all the way. They actually go 360, the legs, like that. And then they go on that kind of, they've got that kind of little butterfly type joint there. And then you've also got this here that moves slightly. So that goes all the way around. So weird, there's some weird articulation points on this droid. And then the um, knee goes all the way. So it kind of tucks into itself. So you've got this um, gap here, this slot, and then you've got this here, and then it just kind of slots in like that. So then you have them folded up like so um, and then the foot goes all the way down and then up and then you've got a pivot on there as well so you can actually get him in some really good um, positions for um, like battle positions and stuff like that so honestly this figure I was quite impressed with and um, the way it came I mean Super Battle Droid, Super Battle Droid can't really do much with the look of the figure but the articulation, I think they've done well with what what they've got. And they've done really well with. So, yeah. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you and goodbye. can change your life. A few friends with the tank can help you feel alive. Find a passion, take some action. And with a little time, just be patient. Make a statement. Try to enjoy your life. They'll try.